Hi, my name's Paul and I'm here today to show you how to fix up pops and crackles and and um, all sorts of nuisance stuff going on with uh, Cubase as far as playback is concerned and some of the problems that you have when you're recording with the recording going out of sync and then dropping out completely. So let's get down to business. The first thing we need to do is click on devices up in the bar at the top then at the bottom of the the window you'll see device setup we need to click on that then on the left hand pane you'll see ASIO Direct X full duplex driver we need to be clicked on that you may open it up and it'll be on something else but just click on that um, here you'll have all your devices that you have at your disposal and the ones you are currently using will be active and checked. Uh, we need to click on control panel which is up here and uh, this will show the setup in this box and the ones that are checked are obviously active. Now the ones that are checked we need to be able to change and when you look at this it sort of looks as though you can't change anything but you actually can change some of the settings here so the first one we're going to do is our buffer sizes and I've found that for me 4000 works pretty well ah, and when you punch it in press enter And I'm only doing the ones that are active, uh, which are checked on the left hand side here, uh, because um, the one I'm not using, we don't really need to uh, do anything with. And that's pretty much it. I have noticed that the offset samples, this is just a little thing on the side I'm letting you know, um, you can change this, this value here. I have not checked this out yet to see what happens. Uh, but it may uh, affect your latency so we click OK the thing will think for a second and then we're done and then you want to click apply and then OK and that should pretty much alleviate your issue just going back to here if you make this buffer size too big, what you'll find is um, your video in Cubase, even though there's not a lot happening, will become choppy. Uh, like when you bring up, say, your mixer, um, instead of being smooth, like, like so, they'll actually just bounce around like every second or so not smoothly so uh, yeah you may have the buffer size a bit big if that happens you can go up to I think it's 16,000 or something so uh, anyway and that should solve a lot of your issues so I hope um, I've been helpful have a great day and uh, We'll see you on the next one. Catch ya.